Today we're going to talk about creating owner teams and assigning security roles to them. So after you log into Dynamics, click the down arrow, go to settings, and then on security. From here, you can click on the teams. Once on this screen, you'll see a list of teams that have already been set up, but we're going to want to create a new one. So we'll click on the new on the top left. From here, we'll want to give our team a new name. And we can select the business unit. We can set our administrator and we'll set it as the current user. We'll leave the team type as owner. If you want to, you can give it a short description to describe uh, what this team will be used for. And after we fill out that information, we can click on save in the top left. Once it's done saving, we'll now be able to add members to this team. So we'll click on the plus button and add a member. Go to the magnifying glass and we'll add Dinesh. And let's see, we'll add one more user. We can add Eric. So now we'll have a couple users on this team and it's set to be an owner team. From here, we're going to want to click on the down arrow next to the name of your team. Click on security roles and we'll be able to assign a few different security roles to this team that will apply to all the team members that we've added. So we can click on manage roles. This will be a list of all of your currently set up security roles. And let's just say we want to add knowledge man manager and marketing manager. You can add as many as you would like here or only one if you want and click OK. All right, now that we've added our roles to our team, it will apply to all the users that we've added. If you'd like to see what each of those security roles that you had set up, just to confirm that everything looks OK, you can actually click into them from here. It will take you back to the summary screen. After here, if you want to add any more of a description or if you want to go back and add any any more team members, you can. And that should show you the basics of how to create a owner team. Until next time.